Ahava and blessings. Welcome to this video where we go into the Crystalline Sound Alchemy course that is launching. I am so excited to be bringing this to you. For those that don't know me, my name is Aria. I am an ordained Magdalene priestess, a Reiki master, energy and sound healer, also known as a sound alchemist. And I work with these beautiful crystal alchemy bowls. They are super powerful, very pure frequency. And this sound healing course was birthed in Avalon, I think at least two years ago or so. And the intention, what came through and the intent is to bring in divine union, divine union within our masculine and feminine, our inner and outer, our body, mind, and spirit. It really was about the alchemy of the soul and how we utilize sound to transform ourselves and in turn, our experience as human beings on this earth. We are energetic beings. Every cell in our body is pulsing and emitting a frequency, an energy. So when we tap into the fact that we are energy and that everything that has happened to us, good, bad, neutral, has an effect on our physical, emotional, energetic, spiritual bodies, our mental body, it makes sense that sound is the quickest and the most powerful way to transmute these energies. The other reason that sound is powerful is because we are also going to be using our voice and your voice is connected to the higher realms just as these high frequencies of these crystal bowls are also connected to the higher realms. So the approach is to bring in divine frequencies and to allow that infinite light, the light that holds no duality, to come into your physical, energetic, emotional, etheric bodies and begin to break down and dissolve, transmute, alchemize the places where you have blocks. As my beautiful teacher Anna loves to say, a block is simply an absence of light. It is a place, um, my upbringing is Buddhist, so when I think of this, it comes into the, the karmic perspective, which karma is neither good or bad. But the way that I receive it is that it is simply a place where we have not accumulated enough positive energy, enough flow, enough. Um, it is simply a place where we, we haven't delved into that realm. It's a part of our soul where we, we just haven't, it hasn't been necessary up until now to focus on those places. And this lifetime, you may feel that there are several or there's only one place in your life where you need to, this, you need this alchemy. And this sound alchemy course is a way for you to empower yourself. I am an energy healer and I can transmute and clear whatever needs to be cleared. However, if you don't know how to clear that frequency yourself, then you're forever at the mercy of someone else. And that is the complete opposite of what I do as a healer and what I do as um, a priestess. What I see as my function, as my mission, is that of holding the space, holding the pristine space for alchemy and for transformation to occur, to share with you through my example, through my wisdom, through what I've received, transcend the ego we must align with our infinite soul with the infinite light of creation with higher frequencies and anchor them in our body the purpose is always to anchor the frequencies in your body because when they are anchored in your body they are anchored into the physical realm you can actually see the effects of your 
work. And it's a beautiful process. So in this crystal sound alchemy course, we are going to be working with these beautiful crystal alchemy bowls. And no, you don't need to have them. I'm going to be doing channeled sound activations for each one of the sephirots. The sephirots are the um, energy centers in the tree of life. And the tree of life is um, much more, I feel, it's much more comprehensive than the simple chakra system, although the two do work together. And I'm going to be sharing what can, what are the signs that show you whether you are in alignment, in harmony, in these energy centers, or you're kind of off. And again, there's no good or bad. There's simply us noticing what is going on within our energy body, within our emotional body, within our mental body, and then within even within our physical body. Because energy, when it is not resolved, when it is not worked through, it becomes physical ailments. So your body is also a key signifier of what is going on within and we are going to work through mantra with mantras with mudras with light activation with movement with aramaic with sound to really allow us to expand to activate to embody to heal and we are going to be embodying the infinite light of our soul this is what this beautiful course is all about and it's it's very exciting it's very it's very empowering for me to be able to share this because it really comes from my heart and from my perspective of showing you how to activate the healer within you how to activate your own codes, your own gifts, your own, your own magic, because every single one of us who had, who is incarnate here on earth has a unique purpose. And what keeps us from actualizing this purpose is the layers of trauma, the layers of doubt, the layers of fear, the judgment, the guilt, everything that we have learned up until now. special happening until the spring equinox and I look forward to holding space for our co-creation for our expansion for our activation for our embodiment of the infinite light of our soul have a blessed day Ahava. and if you have any questions please feel free to comment below or to email me Ahava.